Hi back here, Rick Bushell. Nice to be with you. And I have I got a surprise for you. I've got two people. I don't even know these two that well. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting there. Uh, but these guys travel the world and they 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 house sit. That's what they do for a job. They sold the house. Now they just go around the world, England and Thailand and other places. And this lady here, Karen, loves cooking, and today she's going to be cooking some butter chicken. I've never cooked butter chicken. I've tried. I've failed miserably. But today she says she got something right up our alley. So really nice to have you guys on the show today. Um, Karen and uh, what was your name, Rodney? Rodney. <laughs> Thank you, Rick. Lovely Thanks for inviting us. So, uh, tell us about one of your best trips when you've gone overseas. Five months in the UK with four house sits all over England. Uh, a 350-kilometre walk through Portugal. Yes. Lots of food, of course. Lots of food. It's always <laughs> about the food here. You know that. <laughs> okay, well, that sounds exciting. How exciting does that sound? Uh, probably for most people, it's just a pipe dream, but these two guys are actually doing it. But let's just get right in to cooking that butter chicken. And this young lady here is going to walk us through the, every step along the way. I'd like to thank Rick very much for inviting me onto his YouTube channel, You Can Cook. I'm going to cook my special dish, which is butter chicken, a little different to a lot of other people's, and I'm going to take you through step by step. I have got two tablespoons of butter here, which I melt in a large fry pan. Then I add two cloves of garlic, which I've crushed one onion which is sliced into small pieces added to the butter and I fry it off until it is golden now I like to brown it I like to brown it not just saute it so that it adds more depth to the flavor for the final part of the dish then uh, whilst that is cooking I add my spices where I have cayenne pepper cumin Cinnamon, turmeric, salt. Oh, there's one more and I can't remember what it was. <laughs> Cinnamon. Cinnamon. <laughs> right. Okay. Yes, I remember now. It's cinnamon. So I add these spices that I have to a plastic bag. My chicken is, is all cut into small pieces, which I do whilst the onion and the garlic is cooking. So I throw the chicken into the spices, give it a good shake. When that is finished or mixed up, I add it to my butter and garlic and onion and just brown the chicken off. When that is cooking, going along, I add my full, my full cream, which is a cup of cream. Then I have half a cup of tomato puree, half a cup of tomato sauce and half a cup of sour cream. I mix all that together with a teaspoon of garam masala. And once the chicken has browned, I then add the liquid to it and I allow it to cook for about 15 minutes and that's all it takes. And it's absolutely yummy. Well, we've come to that time now where the true test is and we're gonna taste this. And I can tell you from watching Karen cook this, it's very, very different than the way I would have gone about it. And that's what makes cooking such a great thing is because everything does, uh, everyone does do it very differently. Um, and so you might experience something that you've never had before. So right, we're gonna just taste this real quick. Let's have a try. A little bit of rice. A little bit of chicken. Yes. One of the things I find amazing, Karen, is that oh, it's so sweet and there's not one bit of sugar in it. Mm. Now, I would have put sugar in it and, and the um, coconut milk and all kinds of stuff. <laughs> so, I guess for a healthy version, give this a try. I think you're going to be very, very pleasantly surprised. I think so. This is a healthy butter chicken, if there's such a thing. It's well, still, there is now, if there wasn't. <laughs> it's still rich. It's still it's rich and divine. very tasty, very nice. So. Look, folks, you know what's coming. Get in that kitchen of yours, mix it up, try something like this, and change a few ingredients. Make this dish your dish. I'm Rick Michelle. This is You Can Cook. And stay safe, everyone. You, you can, can cook. cook. You certainly can. <laughs>